Hi. Hello. Howdy. Welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man Battle Number 2 Hard Mode. It occurred to me that even though we bought a power-up last segment, I did not in fact use it. Oh man, we used it. Hooray. So we're almost at max stats uh, across the board, because we also now have 940 HP, which is really nice. Just compulsively saved, by the way. Uh, so now we need to get our way out of this area. And I think this would be the best way to do it, if I'm not mistaken. And it's time for our friends and pals, Dominers. At the very least, I don't need their chip anymore, so I'm less concerned about getting it. Uh, yeah. I'll hold on to Aqua Blade just in case I get the components for Life Sword 3. That would be a little nice to knock out. Because, uh... I don't know. I mean, Life Sword 3 is just a really good program advance in general to have. It's a good secondary one, at the very least, so... If I can show that off, that'd be nice. Unfortunately, we're not going to, because Gator... Actually, maybe we will, because Gator isn't going to get both of them at the same time. Yeah, whatever. The limitations of Gator and pretty much every program advance is that these motherfuckers will tolerate any damage when they're in that form. Uh, and yeah, unfortunately this is not the program advance, but we can still do it. Fuck you. There we go. Having three of each element for the blades is gonna be nice. Okay, I guess of the three blade elements, because there's no wood blade, but there's also no wood sword. Anyways, I'm pretty sure I don't want this, because I have... If I recall correctly, I already have Anti-Recover, because What's-His-Dick gave it to us. Because uh, that, pur that Purple Mystery Data is Anti-Recover. I'm pretty sure we got it from What's-His-Name. Uh, Doc. So let me make sure. Yeah, Anti-Recover D. I, it's just Anti-Recover M. I don't need that. So I'll save myself the Unlocker and just not get it. And a bug frag. I would be, uh, you know, I would be surprised if we couldn't get, uh, if we didn't have enough bug frags at this point to get the, uh, the Zeus hammer from that bug frag dealer. Because it feels like we've gotten, like, three in the past, like, three segments. Not to mention it's been forever and a day since I last checked, I think. Um, all right. Let's just, uh, let's just do this. Fuck it. Probably not gonna get a good ship from this, but it's fine. I'm now obsessed with getting good ships. It is my main goal in life. Along with blowing up and acting like- Oh, hey, cool. Rebo bit too. Don't mind if I do. I mean, my priorities have shifted a bit since we are nearing the end of the game, as you can tell, so. I can't help it. I need to pay attention to this shit. Alrighty, so... Nothing... Oh, there's a, there's a way down there. I should check that. Because I'll find a way, I'll find a way. Man, if I'd held on to Fire Sword R, or Fire Blade R, I could have done, uh... I could have done, uh, uh, oh my god. <laughs> I could have done Life Sword 3. Oh well. We have plenty of time to get Life Sword 3. There's no rush. I'm just being annoyed about it. Alrighty. So somewhere we can go over here. Does this lead to anything interesting? Maybe? Um. Well. I kind of don't want to fight this fight if I can help it. Can I like, can I just leave? Am I allowed to leave? I should probably actually start testing if I can run away from certain fights, but I probably can't. I mean, I'm almost at max HP, though. Are there just going to be fights I can't run away from even at max HP? If so, that would be very annoying, but I also wouldn't be surprised. I mean, it is hard, man. It's what I deserve for not regging an escape chip, clearly. Okay, uh, what is this? Uh, Dead End. Sure it is. Um. Oh, hi. This was the correct way to go. Well, I want to see what's over there first. Okay, fuck this. I'm gonna try it. Ugh, 
for fun's sake. Man. Okay. I just wanted to get that out of the way. Um. Man, if this went, fuck it. Deal, but we'll work with it. God fucking. How did I like roll right into it? Speaking of roll, Lamau. But really, that's that's frustrating. <sighs> I'm, I'm more frustrated by taking damage than I should be, because that was like 400 damage for something I should have been dodging, but whatever. I have no one to blame but myself, so. Yeah. Possible code? Hooray. What is our reward? A blue mystery data with bug frag. You fucking shouldn't have. Uh, hey, perfect opportunity to delete this motherfucker. Bye! That was 280 damage on you motherfucker, so deal with it. Alrighty. Now let's save and talk to this- oh my god. No, it's cool. I just- I'll just go fuck myself. Anyway, it's time to drink water while we watch the Navi kill this guy. Hooray! At least we're getting chips. The chip trader will be very fed when I get around to going to it. I don't get it. How'd you get here? <laughs> Whatever. You'll die here, and that's all that matters. Uh, are you very sure about that? How, how certain would you say you are that I'm going to die? Like, scale of 1 to 10. I mean, granted, your fishy 3 will live, but it won't be able to do much, I can tell you that. This one, who gives a shit? Hi. Okay. I didn't need it, but okay. I made an oversight. The rumor said you were tough, but... But I was only a time stall anyway. A mere time stall. Right now, Gospel Supreme Commander Freeze Man is steadily moving towards the destruction of the world. Hey, where's Gospel's HQ? <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? The HQ is in Kodo Square! W what? Kodo Square? Of all places. Even if you reach it, you're no match for Freeze Man. Freeze Man! Arg! Okay. The Gospel Navi dropped something. Blue Frag B. Now we have two blue frags. Mega Man, head for Gospel HQ. Hold on, man. There's something else here. What is it? Grab it. Mega Man got gospel ID. Cool. This is like a gospel member's card. Come on, land. Off to gospel's HQ. Sure. Cool. You got mail. According to a new report from the Dent Earthquake Center, a quake of unprecedented size is likely to occur shortly. Please proceed to an evacuation center immediately. Awesome. So now, are we going where I think we are? Uh, I'm pretty sure. I mean, obviously we need to go to Kodo Square, but I just want to make sure. Uh, so, head to Den Area 1, go to Kodo Square entrance using the warp point. On the way, ignore the LOS, blah, 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 blah. From Kodo Square entrance, take the moving path and enter Kodo Square. Okay. Okay, cool. Whatever. This is where I think we need to go, so we just gotta deal with it, in quotation marks. <laughs> I don't know. I will say, I do actually like, I do actually like Gospel as a, as a not World 3 antagonist, but it is very dumb, like, in terms of, like, what actually gets revealed about it. 
I don't know. I, I just, I really like the Navi we're about to fight. I think it's a really cool design. Like, it's kind of squandered because of how little you see it in the game. But that's just me. Honestly, Mega Man Battle Number 2 has a lot of Navis that you just never see in the rest of the series. Like, Gate Man. Uh, uh, God, uh, I was just thinking about, like, Cut Man. Cut Man is a really weird one because it's so, like, not Net Navi that it loops around to being a Net Navi. Oh wait, shit! There was a there was a gospel code I could do. I just realized. Uh, and also, yes, I just said that. That sentence made sense to me. It's so not net navy that it's a net navy. <laughs> I swear that that's 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 how my brain works. Anyways, what is this gonna be? Sure, fuck it. I literally just paid four thousand zenny to get twenty six thousand. I'll take it. Besides, it's not really like I need to worry about money anyways. It's just it's just more money I can spend on unlockers now, so who gives a shit? Anyways, the square is, is weirdly empty. Oh my god. Can I get Zeus Hammer? Oh my god, I can't. Really? Eight bug frags? I'm really missing eight. Actually, I guess to be fair, I'm missing uh, uh, 11. Because you need... Because uh, I have 19 in total left to get. Because you get exactly enough to get all of these. So I'm still missing eight. Wow. That's a shame. Uh, I don't even know why I'm talking to you. Yeah, who gives a shit? <laughs> I guess I could buy some unlockers, but... You know what, fuck it, let's buy unlockers, just to be safe. I have so much money, I don't give a shit. And I know I'm gonna have Purple Mystery Data to unlock in post-game, so I'd rather not even have to worry about getting it later, so... Mega Man use Gospel ID, here we go! The whole time we were we were sitting on the gospel HQ. Isn't that sad? Now don't that make you just want to cry your eyes out? Yellow cure. Hooray. Oh no, it's these things that are not very threatening at all. Um yeah, who gives a shit? Let's get roll. Again, I'm gonna not burn the blade ships until I make Life Sword 3, in which case. You know, everything is, 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 is... It's anyone's... Whatever. Oh, Speak of the Devil. Uh, oh, wait, no, that's not a... Okay, never mind. Not Speak of the Devil. Uh, here we go. Now it's Speak of the Devil. F-A-E. I should be doing Gator, but right now I want to show the program advance off. Life Sword 3. So now we're doing 600 damage. Fuck me dead. Oh, that's what I get for not using Gator. That is 100% what I get, so... Whatever. I'll just use Gator immediately, and then we'll have the one Flappy to deal with. It's not the end of the world, it's just... Im oh, God! Wait, what? Wh why did Gator not work? What the fuck? Oh, my God. At this point, I'm actually a little worried now. Like, what the fuck just happened? Um... That's very frustrating. <sighs> okay, um... <sighs> At this point, fuck it. Oh, you're not even there anymore, are you? Man, my life is so much fun in so many different ways. Whatever. Okay, this thing should be dead now. God, I am getting so trolled. It's not a it's not a Mega Man Battle Number Two segment, or just a Let's Play segment in general. If I'm not getting a little trolled, we do a little bit of trolling around here. Whatever. <sighs> For fuck's sake. There we go. Counter over. Is decidedly less impressive than I'd have liked, but whatever. Okay, let's save, and boom. Hooray, Fishy Twos, my favorite. Granted, I probably should be able to deal with them. Probably. <laughs> oh, wait, I, I didn't even look at my screen. Of course I can. I love when I don't look at my screen because I'm doing something like on my list and it's like, oh, I do have easily the way to deal with this. Cool. 
Boom. Perfect. Boom. Butterfly effect. Alrighty. I'm just making edits to my list of chips I still need. Just while I'm in between, like, loading and shit, so... It certainly isn't the worst usage of my time. Just because it does need to get updated eventually. Ah, Jesus, these guys are gonna be annoying. Ah, crap. Uh, well, on the bright side, at least I got roll, so now I can, uh... I can count on her. By count on her, I mean actually get my health back. I like when I'm vague. For no reason. My god, they move too? Oh, Christ. Oh, dear god. Alrighty. There we go. Oh, shit, you're alive? Hello. What are you doing alive, sir? Uh, I need, I need a chip that is not a blade right now. You know, in retrospect, I should've just used, uh... I should've just, uh, taken area grab first and then done some stuff, but whatever. I am not the smartest person I know, unfortunately. I'm only slightly smartest. There we go. And... hooray. At least we're getting it done. Speaking of getting it done, we're now at the end. And look at this guy! It's Freeze Man! Spoilers. He has a cool design, I like him. I'll give you a hand for coming this far, Mega Man.exe. Well jeez, that's like using his last name. Who the heck are you? That wasn't even the Mega Man voice, I just realized. Whatever. Gospel Supreme Commander, Freeze Man. I orchestrated the Civilization Destruction Plan. Soon, a quake registering as high as a 10. As 10. Okay, whatever. Will strike. Shall we find a nice place to watch the destruction unwind? I won't allow it. Now hand over the blue frag. <laughs> no way. Sure, that ice on the net is part of me. But the third blue frag is me. What? So that means... Right! You have to defeat me or you can't save the world. If you really want to stop the end of the world, then give me your best shot. Mega Man! Land, handle the... Excuse me. Land, handle the routine. I think I'm not even doing the Mega Man voice now. It's, it's great. Land, handle the routine. Got it. I'll protect this world and country. Not in that order. <laughs> Whatever. I'm reading poorly. Forgive me. All right, Mega Man, battle routine, set, execute. All righty, so here we are. Our good friend and pal, uh, there's Shadow Man, clearly. No, it's Freeze Man. Uh, Freeze Man is a very easy Navi to fight, unfortunately. It's actually really underwhelming, to be fucking blunt. Also, I just got a lot of good chips for this fight, wow. Um, I actually kind of don't want to use any of these chips right now. Whatever. Uh, Freeze Man is really easy to deal with because he just stays in one place and he kind of just lets you bitch, which, bitch whip him around. Also, I have... I totally have... Uh, I Fuck, I can't use my words. I totally have li Life Sword 3. Goddamn. So we just need to destroy this. Unfortunately, it does... Uh, it does, unfortunately, take some busting. Because if I had used Gator, he wouldn't have uh, taken any damage. It's actually kind of silly that he even got damage on me, but whatever. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, he's not going to move at all. Whatever, let's just burn. Let's just burn it. Uh, but yeah, we just got to wait now. Oh, well. Uh, F-A-E again. I mean, fuck it. Let's just do it just for the shit. Oh, actually, wait, 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 wait. We could be stylish. We could be stylish. Oh my god. I just realized I could do this. FAE, and then boom. Watch the shit. Watch the shit. We're gonna be stylish, y'all. Boom. 
See, there's Life Short, Life Short 3 in action. I'm steadily developing, like, dyslexia or something, since I can't talk. So forgive me. Huh! Who would have dreamed I'd lose? And to you! But it's too late! Only moments till the earthquake. He used the right form of till! Aw, oh, Freeze Man really is the best. You may have beat me, but there's no time to make the cure. <laughs> I'll see the end of the world in a moment. Gospel for all eternity! Something is glowing from Freeze Man's body. Mega Man got Blue Frag. We did it, Lan. We got the Blue Frag. Crack. Ah! Uh, Mega Man, what's wrong? Suddenly, the Blue Frag broke. No way! You gotta be kidding me! What are we gonna do? The world will be destroyed, right? No need to worry. Hello, Doc. He was just here the whole time, okay. The Doc? What are you doing here? I came to see how this all turned out. Looks like it's a happy ending. Take a gander. The ice is breaking up by itself. Right. The Navi you beat seem to be their power source. This powerless ice is starting to break apart. The same thing probably goes for other places. Oof. I'm tired. Long time since I worked. Well then, to the undersquare. Oh, and I'll have to build the officials for the cure and such. How much can I take them for? <laughs> you boys should be going too. Surely everyone's waiting. It's very cool how Freeze Man is like, Oh man, I can't wait to die and let everyone die with me. And then he just fails. That's classic Freeze Man behavior right there. Yes, thank you. Let's get on back home. Or let's get on home, man. Back beside us, everyone. Fuck. Words. Yeah. All right, cool. Well, that was productive. It's okay now. The environment system is thawed and returned to normal. Now the disaster should be suppressed. Lan, Mega Man, you did well. Thanks, I think. Didn't really feel like I did anything, but whatever. Uh, I want to look up one thing real quickly. Where is Freeze Man's data? Because I kind of feel like finding him again. Just just for shits and giggles. Think about what you Freeze Man location. Yeah, that's not the... Yeah, Freeze Man V2, thank you. Uh, Undernet Area 7. Oh, so that's where we were. I'm not going all the way back to Undernet 7 just yet, so... Yeah, I'll pass. But it's good to know that. And we're back home. Let's tell your mom everything's okay. He's, she's your mom too, bro. Mom, everything's okay. Mom, what's wrong? Is she mad? You are father. Cult. And I heard all about it. Well, I... We... Sorry for worrying you, Mom. You two sure know how to make us fret. Land, Mega Man! Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Whatever. Welcome home. I'm proud of you. Mom. Jeans don't lie, just like your dad and grandpa. You have a strong sense of justice, and you act before you think. I would have said that differently if I had known, but whatever. That's your lineage. What's wrong? Have I got food in my teeth? You look just like your father when he was young. You must be tired. How about taking a rest? Okay. Cool. Now what? Want to rest, Lan? Oh, I thought I thought it was implied we rested, but after she said that. Ready for bed? Save your events. This will blah blah blah. Good night, Lan. So now that we've defeated Freeze Man, clearly Gospel is never going to be a threat ever again. Then one week later. Oh, hello. Cut man again? Okay. Quick man now. Huh. Again. Arg! This is endless! Darn, what on earth is going on here? That is everything in Show's report. Show left to look into the incident by Natopia's request. That was three days ago. Hmm. 
Perhaps this is more complicated than we thought. Don't you find it a little odd? Dr. Hikari's son, Lan, destroyed Kotobuki Square. That's a major gospel base, yet net crime is at record levels. Dr. Hikari, is it possible we are overlooking something? Yes. Perhaps we should reinspect Kotobuki Square. But our top net battler show isn't back yet. Or, or do you guys just have broken hands? Like, what's going on? Recent events have destroyed our net battler reserves. Should we get a city net battler to check out Kotobuki for us? Excellent idea. Why, Dr. Hikari's son is a city net battler. Yes, but I fear a line I skipped. And Lan is still an experience. But Dr. Hikari, you yourself said this is an emergency. I mean, Lan did save the world once already. We'll ask all the city net battlers to participate. True. Perhaps the other battlers would be up to it. Very well. Let us ask the city net battlers. Meanwhile, we should all get back to our duties. Right. Cool. Another incident. I know. It's very troubling. Why? They just said that gospel had been destroyed. Yeah. Want to read your mail? Okay. Let's see. Attention all city net battlers. As we believe that gospel is continuing its operations, we request that you reinvestigate Kotobuki Square. What? We beat Freeze Man. So what was that? Well, we can't find out just by sitting around here. Or just sitting around here. Yeah, let's go. Cool, I guess. Uh... I do want to check one thing real quickly. Uh, since we have some chips to burn, I do want to go to the chip trader. Because uh, there's one right here now. Hooray! So, we have a decent amount of chips we can throw in there. Let's see what happens. Darn it! I want heat ball! I want the ball chips so badly. It's not just heat ball, to be honest. It's all the ball chips that are super annoying to get. So, I really, really, really... Oh my god, really? Gutsman Asterisk, that would have been nice, like, 20 segments ago. Whatever. Oh, Yo-Yo won. I guess I can't complain about that, but I probably would have gotten it naturally. I'm pretty sure the Yo-Yo won uh, virus is in the final dungeon, so... Whatever. This is definitely the preferred uh, chip trader to use if you are going to be rolling them. Kunai won! Hey. I don't know if it's like more likely to give you chips that you don't have, but it certainly has helped me the most in my previous... Actually, I don't want to get rid of that barrier. Because I bought those. Uh, I don't want to get rid of that either. Uh, but yeah, it has certainly been the one that's helped me the most historically. So... Yeah. This might be the last chip we get. Meteor 12! I did need that, I think. Yeah, I did. So... I guess that's good to get. These are- a lot of these are chips I could have gotten naturally, so... Yeah, we still have stuff we can do, though. Sword... Do-do... Do-do... Yeah, there's still a lot of stuff I need to get. I know it doesn't seem like it, but I still have a lot of the game left. Proto Man Asterisk! Not gonna lie, that is pretty hot and tempting. Mmm, that is so tempting. Mmm, I- I- I might actually slot that in over roll now. I think I'm going to. It gives me a slightly better folder flow. And it's just, it's, it's just, it's... I love roll, don't get me wrong, but I was mostly using her just because she flowed better than Proto Man. But here, I don't have a good excuse. I don't need healing that badly, so... Man, that was, that was a good pull. Pull. Not pull. Anyways. I want to hold on to the area grab S ships just because god damn it. Well that's a waste. Uh, yeah I want to hold on to those. Shadow 1 I don't give a shit about. Oh I don't have enough to even get into the- okay. Well I still got some decent pulls there so um... Let me check the request board now. Let me see if there's been any last requests that have updated. Last request. Because people are dying. Uh, I might have to do some chip grinding off screen because I definitely want to roll a lot in that. Uh, it would be really nice to just like throw a bunch of them out there. 
So we do have some requests to do. Let's start out with those first. So, oh, I need to split the segment. Perfect timing. Let's do that. So this is going to be a total nothing request because the reward is useless to me, but we got to do it. Actually, I guess we don't got to, but I'm going to do it. I belong to the Electopia Bug Society. I'm looking for a bug I'm researching for the symposium. It's called the Den Beetle and it lives in Electopia. It's a very rare bug and I'm having trouble finding one. I'm looking for someone to help me find this bug. If you can help, see me at the Okuden Valley Campground. Except the show up, of course. So yeah. But yeah, as I was saying, I do still have a lot of this game left to go through. Because I have a lot of chips I still need to collect for trades. I, uh, I still have a lot of post-game to do. Well, I have to start post-game, really. And post-game does take a... Uh, uh, I wouldn't say like a super long time, but it does take a decent amount of time, let's say. Uh, so that is something I'm going to have to worry about, too. Uh, beyond that, I... I just, I also have a lot of Navi chips I still need to get. Sure, it's not going to be, like, difficult compared to, like, Magnet Man, but it is still going to be time-consuming, because we still have to run into those Navis. Which is part of the reason I've been trying to, like, haul ass a bit on making sure they're available to run into accidentally. Where is the fucking Bug Society guy? There he is. Hey, you were on the plane, so you're taking my contract. Well, that's good to know. I probably gave him a funny voice before. I don't remember it. Sorry. Okay, here it is. I want you to find me a den beetle. There should be some around this camping area, I imagine. The den beetle likes places where the water is peaceful. I'm counting on you. That actually reminds me, speaking of navvies, can I refight show? Uh, I'm gonna read the quest while I go to show. Uh, what is peaceful? Uh, oh, it's just on the camp road, okay. Is show still over here? Because if he is, I'm gonna see if I can find him. And he is not over here, awesome. Yeah, I should have expected he wouldn't be over here. Oh well. That's totally fine. I don't need to fight show. To be honest, Proto Man's probably going to be one of the hardest remaining Navi fights to do. So I shouldn't hold my breath on beating him anyways. Or at least, like, I should not be, like, jumping like a coiled spring to fight him. I should be waiting. I mean, Proto Man V3 is a good chip and all, but because it's going to be B code, I don't even know if I'm going to use it. So. Anyways, I think it's over here? No, it's gotta be like over here. No. Okay, is it over here? There's a big black bug swimming here. It's a den beetle, hooray. This is a very nothing request to do because it's so easy and also just like the reward, as you'll see, is not good. I guess it's good if you use recovery chip spoilers, but I never use them. Oh yes, a true den beetle. You, you are a capable man. Here's your reward. Recover 200M. Not a terrible chip, but I already got recover 200W, so I definitely don't need it. I guess it would have been good had I not gotten that. <laughs> oh well. Again, I shouldn't be complaining. In fact, I should be happy. So, while that's going on, before I forget, I do want to actually fight Mr. Match again. Uh, I don't necessarily want to get, like, go for the V2 and V3 chips from Snake Man and Thunder Man, but I do want to at least beat Mr. Match so that way I can, uh, when the time comes and I can rechallenge him, I can just immediately go for V2 and V3. That is kind of nice to break up the monotony of this with, uh, with a Navi refight. Yep. Alright, V2. Unfortunately, I very much doubt you're going to be a threat to me, but at the same time, who knows. If I underestimate you, I might get my ass handed to me, so... God, I just love Heatman's design. Fortunately, Heatman does appear in a later Mega Man Battle Number game, which is nice. Oh, goddammit. I was hoping he moved out of that space. Also, really, are you are you for real? Whatever. Fuck off. Come down here. Why? Okay, fuck you. At this point, my rank doesn't matter. I just wanted to like speed this up a bit. So it's on me for being impatient. And here we go. He'll be almost dead. It's kind of funny that his his sprite is so tall 
that when, he, when he's in the top row, his health number gets blocked uh, by the, uh, uh, the fucking, oh my god, I can't think of the word. The, um, um, oh my god, uh, the, the custom bar. God, I was struggling for that word. Whole term. Anyways, we did kind of shittily, but whatever. Shittily is enough to pass. 50% still passing, baby. Anyways, let's do... After this, let's go finish the last request, because that is actually going to be the last request. Hi, Heat Man. It's kind of a shame. I would have loved to see if I could find a use for Heat Man, because with H Grass Stage, uh, Heat Man could potentially be a good combo. Unfortunately, I don't even want to use his ship, so... Let me just see what it looks like right now. Yeah... Honestly, I, I I really wish there could be like a remake of the Mega Man Battle Network series, or maybe just another Battle Network game type, not necessarily with the Battle Network name, which is generally speaking something where like, you actually get a demonstration of what the chip does. Kind of like uh, uh, Neo The World Ends With You, how like, when you were looking at the pin, that it would actually show you what the pin looked like in action. I fucking adored that so much. It was such a good idea. Because I would love to test those out. Uh, it's also kind of how, like, in Final Fantasy 16, you can go to, like, the Arete Stone and just test out any build you want. Uh, it would be really nice to have something like that. I mean, I guess to be fair, if I was really so curious, I could just put it in my dupe folder and then go to the, like, doghouse or something, but I'm lazy. It's not easy enough. <laughs> Whatever. So, just to check, I've done all the other ones, right? Yeah. Cool. So this is the last request we're doing. Well, the last request in the game. When I'm saying the last request we're doing implies that like I'm doing no more, and there are more, but there aren't. So I work at a jewelry shop in Utopia, and three gems were stolen: Yum Tear, Kingstone, Twilight. I know who did it, but I don't know where he is. Please help me with this investigation. Accept this job, of course I will. So now we have to. This one looks like it takes a while too. Joy of Joys. Uh, so now we need to go to Natopia, obviously. You know, I really, I just realized I should have doubled that up. I should have fought Heat Man after I accepted the request. Ah, whatever. Can't undo it. I don't even know when Heat Man V3 is going to be available. Is this just one of those things where, like, you walk off the screen and then walk back in and he's available? Okay, that's what I thought. Maybe it's after you beat the game and, like, post-game becomes available. Uh, by the way, I want to check one thing real quickly, if this trade is available yet. Because there's going to be a little kid on here who will want to trade ships for- or want us to trade him a bunch of chips for one ship. And I would like to see if he is currently available. Or at least, like, he's in- yeah, here he is, I think. Hey, Electopia is very nice. I'm heading back to Natopia soon. I want to give my brother back home some Electopian ships, but I can't find the ones he wants. You have Shadow Man, Shadow Man V2, and Shadow Man V3? If so, would you like them for my anti-damage S? Please? Sorry, I don't have them. So yeah, uh, for whatever reason, that kid really wants the Shadow Man ships. How he knows about Shadow Man is a mystery to everyone involved, but whatever. So that is something I'm going to have to hold out for. Not that they're particularly hard to get, but, you know, they are something that will be uh, a factor. I'll also have to get uh, uh, multiple Shadow Man ships in that case, because I think Shadow Man's required for a program advance, if I recall correctly. Um, yeah, he's required for the Bodyguard program advance. So I'll either want to get multiple Shadow Man ships, or I'll have to high show. I'll have to do it before I trade it. Probably want to do the latter, though. Or the, the former. Can I fight Show? I don't need to say it, but can I fight him? Since yesterday, excuse me, since yesterday, virus activity is off the charts. Lynn, get ready to fight any kind of enemy. Can I fight you? Sure, I was tired of getting, of fighting amateurs. V3, wow! Wow, he has a lot of HP for V3, too. Okay. Uh, I'll give it a shot. I'm not holding my breath on this being a very successful attempt, though. Uh, not at all, so. He's gonna be basically like Magnet Man, but a little bit worse, because uh, I do in fact need to... Wow, this sucks. Uh, I do in fact need to get, uh, basically three Gators to deal damage to him. Nice, I knew you were doing that, you fucking moron. Uh, 
do this dick now. Watch this shit. Honestly, he might not be that hard if I just use that strategy of just, like, baiting him out. You know, maybe I can get this. Who knows? I definitely have a little bit more confidence in my abilities now that I, uh... Now that I, uh, uh, uh was able to get Magnet Man. Okay, is this gonna damage or are you gonna block it somehow? Okay, cool. Yeah, I actually think I could get this. Okay, you're dead now, bitch. You know, just to rub salt in the wound, I'll beat you with yourself. Or not, okay. Is that a V3 delete? Holy shit, okay. Again, I expected this one to be a really hard one to get. And here I am just like casually like, Oh, can I fight you, Proto Man? Sure, I'd love to fight. <laughs> Alright, man, fuck it. I... Humble brag moment. Yo, I deserve it. After the fucking shit that I went through in Mega Man Battle Network 1's Let's Play, I deserve some convenience. Uh, now at this point, I kind of want to like... I kind of want to go out of my way to get... Uh, also, 200, that's pretty good. But it's a B code. That's the problem. But it's 200 damage. 200 damage is nothing to sneeze at. Besides, I just like Proto Man, so... Uh, but yeah, now I really want to go out of my way to get V2 just so I don't have to fight Proto Man anymore. So let me try that. Maybe if I'm lucky uh, and I just do shitty enough naturally, I'll get uh, V2. <laughs> I'll get V2 just by by accident, because I already don't really have a good uh, hand. But at the same time, I'm smart, so who knows? Uh, Evo, the Katamari Damacy creepy pasta. Uh, <laughs> instead of you are smart, the voices are saying you are dumb. Oh, I'm gonna take damage. Awesome. Oh, it's, it happens to the best of- Oh, what the fuck? Oh, what the fuck? Double what the fuck moment, okay. Um... Yeah, so I want to do this. Okay, um... That's not enough for Gator, though. Okay, there we go. Now I'm hitting you with yourself, bitch. Okay, and then I still don't have Gator for real? For fucking real on that one? Whatever. I I think I I think I can get V2 here. Yeah, if I just get Gator. Okay, here we go. This is Gator. Maybe because I took damage, I can get V2. It would be so fucking convenient if I just got the V2 on my first try. Honestly, at this point, V2 is like more concerning to me than V3. I'm actually really like I'm really I really feel like jacking myself over this. Oh, it was a V3. God damn it. I did too well. But see what I mean when I say V2s end up being the harder ones to get sometimes? Whatever. Man, Gator just breaks this game, even on hard mode. I really thought hard mode would change things, and it really doesn't. For better and for worse. Anyways, I think my I think I need to take damage twice now. So once I have a winning hand, I'll just take damage twice to be safe. Because that should get me down to like a nine. Maybe a ten. I don't know. Um sure. Here. Invis 3 really is the uh the lifesaver for this one. Oh, fuck you too, buddy. Uh, here we go. Wait, was that right? No, wait, wait, I had it in the wrong order. I'm glad I checked. I had a feeling I had it wrong. Okay, so now I just need to do 200 damage. Does Twister do 200 damage? I don't remember, to be honest. You know, I know it does do 200 damage. It's, a uh, Gator. Or, not Gator. Uh, Gate Man. So now I just gotta do damage twice. Please damage me. Please damage me. Okay. Alright. Just get near me now. Fuck! Oh, now I'm not gonna give V2. I'm gonna give V1, because I fucked up. Uh, 
I'm a mo- Oh, you know, Proto Man saves the day. Literally saves the day. Literally s- I don't know. Hey, V2! It only took a, it only took a second attempt. I'm happy. I'm very happy in general, actually. Goddamn. So, that is uh, the Proto Man Navi chips down. I could probably... Honestly, I'm really tempted to now go for Snake Man and Thunder Man. You know what? Fuck it. Might as well. If I could do Proto Man and Magnet Man, I can do fucking... I could do those two. Thunder Man can be a little annoying, but I'm not very worried about him. So, fuck this. No, I wanna... Fuck off. I wanted to fight you. Alrighty, let's make something happen. Also, I got my... I got, uh... Life Sword 3 already. And the biggest shame in the world is I can't really use it. <laughs> That's hugely disappointing, but whatever. I mean, at this point, it's more just nice to be able to have the animation, I guess. I don't know. It'll be more useful in the future, trust me. Uh, again, I... Well, actually, no, this isn't Life Sword. I just got a lot of them. I am getting rid of a lot of these chips that I need. You know, the good news is, if I fuck this up, this is, uh, a convenient way to get my, uh, to get Gate Man, or, not Gate Man, Thunder Man, um, oh, that's fan. To get Thunder Man V, uh, 2. So, I should look at it that way. Cool. I mean, ideally, I would get V3 first, but... I don't know. I guess, I guess ideally it really doesn't matter. Ideally, I don't take that long to get either, so. Um... Uh, that's a shame. Although, the way this works out is now I just need to get hit. I just need to hit with Gator. So, yeah. I kind of missed when I had area grabs for this fight because Tornado or Twister really opens up his asshole and never lets go. Like, it really just strangles him with his own colon. But, uh, speaking of strangling him with his own colon... I feel like this Let's Play must be the most boring shit in the universe to watch. Just because it's literally just me doing Gator every, like, 20 seconds. I don't have a defense, I'm sorry. It's just, it's such a useful program advance. Anyways, that's, uh... That is Thunderman V3, so now let's go for V2. I really wish you could just get V2 automatically. It would save so much time. Um, yeah, let's see this. So, it takes only two gators to kill after we do this. And he's not very difficult to, to gator in the first place. Uh, my god. Well, we're gonna be waiting a bit. I don't regret having the blade chips in my folder. It's just they're definitely the thing I need to get rid of anytime they show up in my hand. Uh, they are definitely uh, not very useful for almost every Navi fight. I mean, there are a few they could be useful though. Like Heat Man, the Aqua Blades are pretty nice. Honestly, Life Sword Three in general is nice for Heat Man. Um. Okay. Like, yeah. Do I have, I have fire, aqua, a luck. Here we go. Okay, let's do this. Just to show it off. Just to be fancy dancy. I mean, that also gives me an excuse to just kill with, uh, with, um, um, Twister. Which means I can do this a bit quicker. Maybe not quicker, actually, but whatever. So now I just need to take damage. Hurry up it. Okay, that's good enough. Uh, yeah, I'd rather actually just use Gator now that I think about it. Mache. There we go. Cool stuff. Is this gonna be V2? Please be V2. Please be V2. That was V3? God damn it. You're being too generous to me. I'm trying to sandbag. Ah. I'm so mad that this game is being nice to me. I'm so angry-licious about it. Uh, 
un un I can do fucking uh, Life Sword 3 again. And yet, I can't do anything with it. For no reason, I will put it in the program advance order. I just like doing it. It wastes time. Also, I just realized I'm going to be using it by accident. Whatever. Um, again? Oh my god. Here, this time I'll just do whatever order. Oh, I, I swear I didn't plan that. I swear I was just doing whichever order. <laughs> whatever. Uh, here we go. In the next turn, I'll use Airy Grab. See how much Twister's doing. I feel like Twister's gonna open up uh, so many fucking holes into his stomach and just pump them full of acid. Oh, here's Gator. Okay. Yeah, Gator will be good for when I'm uh, when I'm ready to kill him. Okay. Unfortunately, he's too weak now, so now I can't dig around with him. Uh, I need to take more damage. Well, I need to take damage, and I need to get, like... I need him to, like, actually damage me pretty decently. Okay, that's... that's three hits. I feel like that should bring me down to a nine. Or an eight, maybe? I think nine can still give me two. I don't think eight can. Oh, we can! Okay, cool. So three hits takes you down to eight if you're doing... If you're doing that. That's good to know. Cool. Alrighty. Bye forever, because we're never going to be dealing with you ever again. Although, I'm still undecided on which scenario... Or which, uh... Which version of Mega Man Battle Number 4 I'm doing. So maybe we will see you again. But, anyways. So now, we have, uh... Snake Man. Who is less of a threat than... Than like wet tissue paper at this point. Uh, oh my god, I could fucking open up his hole and just go to town. I'm about to destroy this man in so many ways. Uh, yeah, let's do this. stuff. Uh, I don't necessarily need this, though. Oh, uh, win do. So now we just play the waiting game. It's funny how a saying man is just like a, a negative presence in terms of danger. Um, that said, it is a little disappointing that I can't do anything about him. Whatever. Um, I guess let's hold on to Proto Man and then a fan just to get rid of them. Fucking. There we go. This should be V3. I'd be very surprised if it's not V3. I'd be so surprised. I'd eat my hat. I don't know why people started saying that. Oh, come on! Be adult. Oh, shit. You know what? Now's a good time to just go for the V2, then. If that happens, I might as well. Might as well make the most of it. It's, it's, it's a blessing in disguise at that point. Oh, I don't have... Oh, dear. I didn't have another... I must have gotten rid of it by mistake. Oops. Well, this is definitely going to be V2. Oh, dear. Oh, this is definitely going to be V2. Actually, it's going to be V1. Yeah, that's V1. Holy shit. Oh, no, it's V2. Okay, that actually is great, then. Then that wasn't a waste of attempt. That does, however, illustrate to me that I need to take him a smidge more seriously than I was taking him. So... Alright, let's try this again. This time, let's be serious. Well, let's take him serious. Uh, ooh, I can, uh... If I get area grab, I can do life, life, uh... Yeah, life sword. I'm saying life sword. Life sword, life sword, life sword. But, yeah. Okay, um... I actually kind of want to hold out for life sword. Uh, but I can't. 
I, I can't afford to. It's a waste of time. I hate saying that, but it is, it is more important to get out Gator, so... Gator does more damage, is more integral to my folder, etc, etc. So... Besides, it's actually easier to manipulate Snake Man into being Gatorable. Like this. You just have to be patient. Also, he only takes two Gators. So he's uh, utterly in... Quite possibly the most silly fucked. Uh, hi, is that? No, that's not. That's not. That's not what I needed. No, you, you ruined my groove. Yeah, eat, dumb. All right, let's add these. So now I just need to not take damage. How difficult could that be? And is that the fight? I think that's the fight. So I just gotta wait for that snake to move a little bit, and we're good. Okay, we're good. Yeah, see, Snake Man's not a fight. Snake Man is not a Navi in this game. Don't you can't convince me. I'm back to taking him not seriously. There we go. Cool. Well, that was uh, that was refreshing. So we just got a bunch of Navi chips that we I didn't expect to be getting this early. So now we only have Quick Man, Cut Man V2, Shadow Man, Night Man, Magnum Man V2, the Freeze Man chips. Heat Man, and then end game or post game navvies. That sounds like a lot, but realistically, it's not really. So, welcome. Oh, you're a net battler. I posted the request. Actually, the three most expensive items in my shop were stolen. The perpetrators were none other than the three bandit sisters. They're out to steal jewels around the world. If my boss found out about this, I please get the jewels back from the three bandit sisters. It's reported that when approached, the bandit sisters release viruses, so be careful your PET doesn't get affected. There's been a reported sighting of them by the castle. Oh yeah, they apparently have a peculiar dialect. Is that enough info for you to find them? Well, next time we'll be looking for these peculiar dialected sisters who have stolen jewels. I don't even really think the- I don't even really give a shit that they stole. I'm just doing this for completion's sake, so. Either way, that's what we'll be up to next time. I'll see you then.